There are lots of really good videos about how to change the batteries in various models of iPhones. This video is not about that. What isn't covered very well is how to replace the seal in the iPhone, and many of the batteries don't come with replacement seals. A lot of the batteries, aftermarket batteries, don't come with the seal that gives the newer iPhones their water-resistant capability. And if you actually look at the phone, you'll see that there's a little, um, little rail, a little, uh, little trowel area, trough area, around the whole uh, inner edge of the iPhone. And that's where the seal goes. And what we're going to do is we're going to, since we didn't get any kind of a seal with the battery, um, I've selected a product called Alex Plus, which is really readily available in North America. It's usually used for um, doing patchwork around drywall before you paint to fill in any little cracks. It is a silicon product. It's also water soluble for easy cleanup. Um, it's waterproof and unlike something that's more of an adhesive like household goop, which I might be tempted to use, this isn't quite as much of as, as an adhesive. So if we do need to take the phone apart again, this should be easier to take apart than if I use something else like household goop or um, shoe goo or any of those sorts of products. So that's why I've selected this. So what we've done is we've preloaded a little syringe with, uh, this has a special sort of needle on it that isn't pointy. Um, this is used for actually attaching to a tube for various medical procedures. So you can, you can get something like this. You could probably use a syringe with a regular needle. I think this one, because it's not pointy, is ideal for the job we have. And so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna start um, on the far side of the phone. So over here, we're gonna start by putting a bead uh, right around, right around here. And I'm gonna smooth that out in a second so any of those little bumps are gonna go away. So I'm gonna smooth that out. And we're gonna continue right around the whole phone. So going over to this edge. This is actually forming a better bead now than I was before. And we're gonna make this bead go right around the whole phone. Oops, there we go. Finish off this side. And that last little bit in the corner there. Now, I'm just gonna smooth out any areas that look like they need smoothing, maybe a little bit there. Um, a little bit right in here, and there's more there than I want. Okay, I think we're, uh, I think we're good to seal this up. So when we actually push the phone together, it'll bring the, the bead together as well. So to put the phone back together, we simply start, you start at the camera end, so you tilt the, the top in to the body, and then you go around the edges, like that, and because this is water soluble, what we can do is use a little water and take off any remaining sealant that's on there 
that may have come out around the edges. So once you have it all sealed up, it feels good. We can then put the little pentalobe screws back in. These are really small. And don't over tighten these, just put them in a gentle amount of light hand tightness. And again, on this side. And let's just make sure it works. How do you turn, there we go. We still got a little bit of silicone to wipe off, so while this boots up, we'll just wipe it down, get rid of any of that. Again, water-soluble silicone product makes it easy to clean up. There you go, working iPhone, resealed. Amazing.